Yippee! <laughs> Hey everybody, this is Lance here at Trans West Truck Trailer RV located in Belton, Missouri. Today I have the pleasure of showing you this beautiful 2006 Monaco Diplomat. This is going to be a 40, BD, uh, 40 uh, PDQ. It's going to be equipped with the 400 ISL motor, so a lot of power packed into this guy with the Allison 3000 transmission. It's the perfect component for size, power, it's going to have a 10,000 pound hitch. Now, one of the things that I appreciate about what they've done with this Monaco product is unlike what you see in the newer motorhomes today, they actually come with not four airbags, but eight. And they're put on outriggers, so you get an airbag in the front of the tire, an airbag on the back, and they're put on outriggers. So uh, where typically you have airbags more in that center frame, these airbags are on the outer edge of the frame. So when you get those side winds, it's not gonna, it's gonna do a really good job of countering any of that. So it makes a great driving experience. So pretty neat construction here with the uh, semi monocoque construction. Really nice cargo capacity for such a short coach. All roto all rotocast there. You could take a hose, spray it out, makes it very easy for cleanup and these doors shut really nice. I mean, they just did a great job in building this coach. Gonna have your battery bay here, your house and chassis all located in the same area. Got your, I think your inverter here in the next one. Yep, got your Magnum uh, 2000 watt inverter there. Access to your uh, rear radiator. You got your air filter indicator. And again, 10,000 pound hitch backup camera and for an 06 it's always nice to see that your rock guard survived sometimes they don't make it you got your surge guard protection here so it will uh, you do have a setup to where it protects the electrical inside the coach docking light very nice to be able to light up your coach late at night Monaco did a really good job with their wet bays it's nice to see your your fresh your gray and your uh, black tank your L, your uh, propane indicator to see what your levels are. You got a, uh, a spigot here, so if you want to hook up a pressure sprayer, you do have a water, external water supply here, so you can hook it up and clean the coach. Next bay over is our propane, and you'll notice that it goes across the coach. And the reason why they take it across the coach, and instead of having it on just one side and having your coach a little bit offset because of weight, they like to have that even weight distribution. So intelligent design by Monaco. Again, just uh, the other access here to that cargo. So now we just got this thing in, haven't had a chance to detail it. So um, above you will see, we got the window awning there, got the carefree window awnings, slide toppers above each of the slides. This is gonna be the electrical bay does have side cameras, so as you're making them left and right hand turns, you can see what's going on uh, next to you. Well, that's just a quick peek of the outside, guys. Let's go ahead in and see what we got going on on the inside. All right, guys, well, welcome to the inside of this beautiful Monaco. We're gonna start up here in the front because for an 06, uh, you typically don't get some of the features that I'm gonna show you here. Um, for instance, when you look at the steering wheel here, you can see a lot of the smart functions, your cruise control, your wipers, all on the steering wheel, tilting, the telescoping, um, backup camera, side camera, all very nice. And then you also get uh, over here, you're gonna have uh, auto leveling. It does have adjustable pedals, so you can bring your pedals in and out from underneath the dash. All very nice features to have. Of course, with the Allison 3000 transmission, you get the exhaust brake, so a lot of neat features. Um, power seats on both sides, adjustable armrest. You do have uh, two couches here. Now this one over here uh, is gonna be a hide -a bed so this one will pull completely out, where this one will be a jackknife. So, um, you can get two different beds. Uh, you can get these both open and get some pretty decent uh, sleeping space here. Now, as far as the uh, coach itself, having two opposing slides 
as you can see it really opens up the space quite nicely so a lot of room packed into this 40 foot coach you got a beautiful dinette here um, i think this thing weathered really well this is all real solid wood cabinets you don't get that photo laminate something that new uh, monaco was really well known for is good custom coaches and all hands-free cabinetry very deep cabinetry now across from the dinette here you can see beautiful kitchen you do get the uh convection microwave so that's an oven as well as a microwave really decent uh space here below now you do get a uh, gas cooktop it'll be a three burner stove you get your dual sink and i actually like this little area here too so a lot of neat place maybe to put your like a curry coffee pot so uh, just a neat floor plan all, all in all does have a residential refrigerator refrigerator freezer stainless which is always a nice feature now this is going to be a mid bath coach so as you can see you got your beautiful uh, vanity here good size shower and then you do get your bathroom now what i like about this is that the toilet and the shower are completely separated so if you're back here in the bedroom and somebody is using the restroom you're not trapped in the bedroom and louvered closets typically mean you get your washer dryer here behind this door with some good storage here just above it now coming into the um bedroom here you'll notice this is a queen bed but it looks like they actually downsize it if you look at that space between the cabinet uh, if you did want to up it to a king very very possible great closet space and then just to the left of that you do get some additional drawers and closet and some really uh, good drawer space here at the foot of the bed as well now behind this tv is some more additional storage so for an 06 i think this thing had about 82,000 miles on it so um, for a diesel motor an isl motor uh, she's actually pretty healthy sounds really well i actually drove it drives really nice if you guys are interested in this coach if you have any questions feel free to give me a call again lance here at TransWest. you can catch me here at 208-290-5750 i look forward to hearing from you